Going back to stores, a taxi that flies, and a new summertime treat. Here are five things to know before you go to bed. Rising inflation is making deal shoppers out of a lot more people, and more of those shoppers are going inside stores. A couple of new reports find online grocery sales in the U.S. are down year over year in April as grocery prices rise. Instead, shoppers are going into the store hoping to find better deals. The studies also found shoppers have fewer fears of the pandemic. Target is cutting prices after an unsuccessful start to the year. The chain says it will have discounts on several products to sell extra items in its inventory. The chain's first quarter profit decreased 52% compared to the same time last year. To generate sales, Target says it expects to increase its supply of groceries and house essentials. A new tech startup wants you to let go of high gas prices and get around town from the skies. Volocopter, a soon-to-be flight service, says it's successfully completed a test flight of an all-electric four-seater air taxi. The copter can fly 60 miles at speeds up to 155 miles per hour. The two-seater began service will begin service rather in 2024 at the Paris Olympics and the company hopes to go commercial in 2026. New York City Council will vote later this month on renaming a quarter of the Lower East Side Beastie Boy Square after the rap group. The area is important to the New York group after it appeared on the cover of their 1989 album Paul's Boutique. Supporters have been fighting for the right for about nine years now. And Wendy's has added a twist to an iconic treat. The burger chain announced it's adding the strawberry frosty to its menu for a limited time. Wendy says this is a long time request from fans. There you go, five things to know before you go to bed.